Good evening everybody and welcome back to another episode of Janners on Tour. Today is Tuesday the 9th of October 2018 and Plymouth Argyle are in action tonight against Swindon Town in the Checker Trade Trophy. Today I've just come back from work from a long day teaching year one so I thought it'd be a great idea to go to Argyle tonight. Now I wasn't actually going to go tonight but Rich is selling programmes and um, the wife is seeing a friend, so I thought, why not? So tonight, um, there will be a small crowd at Argyle watching us in Secretary Trophy action. Now, hopefully tonight will be a good chance to see some of the players that haven't started many games. So maybe Dyson might get a chance, maybe even Fletcher. So, tonight, um, it will be good for them to get a run out and hopefully maybe get the win um, to take us, you know, against uh, Chelsea in the 23s. Now, I'm not a massive advocate of this cup, but I think winning breeds success, so the more we win, the more confidence goes up. And of course, we have two familiar faces back tonight in Diego Aura, who was on loan last season, and of course, Super Luke McCormick, who may be in goal for Swindon, so it'd be great to see those two. So, today I'm going to go for a Argyle win, I'm going to go for 2-1 to Argyle, um, I think we should have enough against the League 2 team, and it'll actually be good to hopefully see us maybe dominate a team for once, even though it isn't our first team. So, I'm at Mum's at the moment, just finished work at school, so I'm going to be having tea and then heading up to Home Park to meet Rich later on. So you will see me at Home Park for Argyle versus Swindon in the Checker Trade Trophy this evening. Keep it green. One! Ooh! Like the Sanders, it's going to be doing Bad rich, eh? No, not bad. Everything in short. Yeah. Just nobody said. Yeah. But I think I oh, bet we need to have a dose But uh, oh, it... Yeah, Fletch is too small. Yeah. Uh, but in that fact, this is the last one what I let Fletch to be. Yeah. Oh no! Well done! No. <laughs> yeah. Oh, save! Big oh, save! Oh. Oh. Ah, damn! Mark Victor! No, offside! Offside! No, it's not, no. It's a goal, yeah, it's a goal. Damn. So Swindon 1-0 up. Don't deserve it. Come on, Argyle. He's shown that they're already screwing so, uh, at the moment. Oh, I wonder if it's it. Come on. Don't let that be talking about it. I can't do it. Why open on that? So. Oh! Good effort. Not bad effort. Yo! Come on! I did this part! The mirror just hit the bar from like two yards out. Oh, damn it. Oh. Friggin' hell. 2-0 Swindon. So just after hitting the post, they've scored. Shocking. We made it look stupid by a League 2 team, yeah? Not good, Rich, eh? Nah, uh, it's all not. They're like, they're not boring, but really. They're no. Deep, they're 
The problem is, I know this is a nothing game really, but they should be trying their hardest because they're not going to get picked for the first team playing like this. What a joke. Uh. Waste of a tenner. Hang your heads, boys. What's that, Rich? Absolutely shocking. Yeah, uh, where we fall. Not worth the, the hassle, this is it? Nah, don't let like them to warm it up, really. Yeah. Let not be bothered by No, no. So we're just back outside Mum's now, just dropping Rich off. And that game was absolutely abysmal. Poor, there was no passion, and I know it's only the Czech Trade Trophy, but you have to show more if you're a professional footballer. Swindon Town made Plymouth Argyle look like a conference team or worse tonight, and they're a League Two team. Now, I know we won on Saturday, but if we play like that against Oxford on Saturday, we will be hammered. And I know it wasn't the full team today, but it wasn't that far off. So, to be honest, I'm not very happy tonight. Waste of a £10. I know it's a meaningless match, but that's not going to do good for confidence in my eyes. And it's a poor, poor evening for Plymouth Argyle. What do you think, Rich? Uh, I thought if it were a time for Argyle, I'd never bother to no. well, watch the detail out of normal match that don't for us. And we expected, didn't we, for them to actually, you know, try and have a positive result today against a lower league team and get some confidence, but not a single thing. Nah, Wyndham looked better on the ball. We'd have yeah. never bet them. We'd have taken it uh, easy as you done. Yeah. Luke McCormick, nothing to do, really? Only one save in the second half, no. but nothing what you do don't teat now. No. So, Rich, Saturday, away to Oxford United in the league, okay, a massive game. Will he go back to full strength? I think he'll go back to f mainly the team on Saturday. Yeah. So put Kerry back in and Ladapo. We have to win that game, do you agree, Rich? Yes. Yeah, and the pressure's back on if not. 
a lot of better, and I think the better we're not to after tonight. I think it, yeah, it may be detecting more of the better. Yeah. Okay, guys. So unfortunately, this vlog has a very negative finish to it, but we deserve better as Argyle fans. Even my bobble fell off of my hat. Shows how bad a day it was. So you're gonna see. <laughs> Plymouth Argyle versus Gillingham is the next vlog in two weeks during half term, so I'll be on my school holidays as a teacher then. So you'll see Argyle versus Gillingham in two weeks. Before that, they have Burton at home. Obviously, I'm not at that one, but Rich, you can give some feedback on that one at the Gillingham vlog. I will do, yeah. Yeah. So we will see you for Argyle versus Gillingham in two weeks, and hopefully, we'll have won some more games and got some more points. Keep it green. Keep the faith. Goodbye. Bye.